Today I am getting a dope ass piece from Chewy on my shin. I don't have nothing on my right leg, so I'm gonna get a big ass angel because my whole right leg. I really want Franco and Chewy to do like a do do the whole thing. I just want to get like portraits and, and angels and stuff on my whole right leg. And my legs are really white, so I figured well, might as well go to the best black and gray dude so my shit just stands out and pops. I started going full on with tattoos probably when I was about 17. I was to the point where I was like, I just wanted sleeves, so I was just getting outline after outline. I wouldn't color anything. I was like, I'll oh, just throw another piece on there. And and, and, and I'd say like 1920, I was like, oh, I better, I better fill this in. And I want color. Now I'm to the point where I hate color. I want black and gray. I pretty much got my whole dome tattooed now. I got like maybe one or two more sessions with Franco. I'd, uh, one of my buddies in Colorado did one of my daughter's names on the side. Um, John Caleb did the right side with my other daughter's name and then Franco pretty much did the whole rest of my head and all the background. I got a portrait of my wife. I got a dove on the back. I got a rose on the back and just a whole bunch of filler and we're pretty much done. We, we've got a, I probably got a good six, six sessions with Franco on it already and I think we got two more. We haven't put any white in it yet. So I have to bring my hairline down a little bit. It still it still goes too far back and my hair grows out of it when it grows in. So looking forward to finally getting my head done. I've always wanted my head done. I've, I've been trying to talk my wife into letting me get it done for years. And then finally one day I like hit her up at the right time. She's like, yeah, I think it'd look pretty cool. I'm like, yes. <laughs> Gotta keep the wife happy, you know, at the same time. I've known uh, Chewy's work for a long time. Like um, I've seen him do work on lots of dudes and I've asked like, who did that? They're called Chewy. And I'm, I've always heard of him. I always knew who he was and then I finally actually met him through Travis and I seen some shit that he did on Trav and when I was thinking about getting an angel, I was like, first thing that clicked in my head was like, Chewy, dude, his angels are so dope. Just like the detail and like how, how good his pieces come out afterwards and that's when I was like, all right, let me make sure this is what I want. I've been thinking about it for a while and I finally I just hit him up a couple weeks ago. I was like, yo, I want to see about getting an appointment. He's like, Thursday, five o'clock, I go, I'll be there. <laughs> I think it's funny when people come up to me in grocery stores and tell me I ruined my body, but for me, this is my body and I'll do whatever the fuck I want to do with it. And they always tell me, what about when you're 80 or you're 90? It's going to be a blob. I go, as long as I have fun and I'm enjoying my tattoos and my body now, who gives a fuck? So mind your own business, bitch. <laughs> That's what, that one always bothers me when people do that shit. I say, it's me. I do what I want to do. You do what you want to do.